Creon says that I killed Laos. What does he have of his accusations? He sent a lying prophet to me. Listen to me and hear that truly humans have no control of prophecies. For I have proof. There was an oracle that came to Laos and said that it was his fate to fall victim of his son's hand. A son born to Laos and I. But you see, the king was killed by foreign robbers when three roads met, as far as we know. And for the son, and before he was three days old, Laos had pierced his ankles and left him by other hands to die. So you see, there's no way that Apollo's prophecies were true. So don't spend so much time writing about it. You must come back and rule as king, because King Polybus is dead, and you are the heir. I will not, for fear of fulfilling the prophecy that I shall marry my mother and kill my father. Because of that, I will not go home until my mother is dead. There is no need to fear the prophecy, for King Polybus is not your father, and his wife not your mother. You were abandoned by your parents, and they took you in as a child. How can this be? I must know who my parents are. I, I have to find them. It is because I wish you well that I give you this counsel, and it's the best counsel. Oh, Oedipus, God help you. God keep you from the knowledge of who you are. Oh, Oedipus, unhappy Oedipus, that's all I can call you. And the last thing I shall ever call you. Maybe she is afraid of my low birth. She shouldn't be. Even if I do prove a slave, my mother a slave, my father a slave, she will not be proved a slave. I believe this is the herdsman we're already looking for. I must go seek him out. In the sea, in the sea. <laughs> <laughs> And the last thing I shall ever call you.